Yo, what is going on guys? Horcrux here. Welcome back to the channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be going over some class breaking bugs on the Magicka Necromancer. It honestly makes this class unbearably hard to play if you're not aware of the bugs and how to counter them. And that's just what we're going to do in today's video. So let's hop right into it. Welcome back, fellas, and before we get into the bread and butter of today's video, huge shout out to my patrons. You guys are absolutely amazing, as is everyone who watches the content on my channel. Also, I'm doing a PvP Top 5 series that will be in a card in the top right-hand corner of your screen if you're interested in submitting clips and having them shoutcasted every Friday, weekly. Hit me up, because I need more clips. One more thing, I got bone to pick with everyone who watches the content on my channel. 72%! Of my viewers are not subscribed before you watch any more of this video you are not allowed to go on you can't skip you can't do jack shit until you hit the subscribe button horcrux forbids it okay absolutely cannot it's forbidden to everyone who's not subscribed i'll wait done okay so a few bugs we won't go over um uh, I got this idea from Anise Gaming. I will leave a link to his channel down in the description or a card in the top right hand corner as well. He goes into some of these bugs more in depth, but I just bring it to you guys' attention. As you guys know, I started a, a macro up recently. I need to get some gameplay for you guys because I don't want to be a two trick pony you know, for the rest of my ESO career, right? So we started a macro and it's a lot harder than it sounds. Macro is not, uh, not, not an easy class. It is very hard to master, but some of the bugs I want to go over. Um, he does mention a, a ninja nerf to your boneyard. So again, there will be a link to his uh, channel in the description and also the, the video. So essentially, when you cast boneyard, uh, there's like a like a uh, quarter second to half second delay in which you can actually activate the synergy. This is for balancing purposes, but the way Zoss went about it, this isn't any patch notes. I really wish Zoss would have a whenever they do a hot patch or patch notes, just have it listed on the UI, the the, the front page launcher, launcher, uh, you know, of ESO. That would be fantastic instead of having to go and dig around in the forums of all the niche changes that they made. This is not mentioned anywhere. Um, it, so you can actually test this. He tests this. So long story short, everyone else can activate your synergy before you can. So the user who activates Boneyard or Grave Robber has like a half a second delay at which they can activate it. And it makes it really hard to line up the, the harmony burst. And you guys know on Mad Crow, it's very tough to play the class without playing a, some sort of harmony build. So um, this is really detrimental to the class. And that's one of the first things I want to go over is just a half a second delay on the synergy. And in addition, guys, when you activate the synergy, it's where your guy is standing, not the middle of the synergy. Just FYI. So speaking of synergies, that's going to lead us into... Uh, the uh, the next couple of bugs I have here. So upon playing on stream, a lot of the times I would throw my boneyard down. I couldn't activate this synergy. I could never figure out why. So we investigated on stream as to why that is, and we did come to a conclusion. So when you, I want you guys to look at the the two differences here. Okay. So we're gonna throw a boneyard down uh, right here. Look, I can't activate it. Why is that, guys? All right, cool. So let's throw a boneyard down over here. Look, I can't activate it, guys. Why is that? over here can activate it you know why is that so the trick is you cannot sprint cannot fucking sprint is a sprint bug i i don't know how long this has been in the game because i just started playing macro i can imagine how frustrating this is is for you macro veins i'm sure you guys already figured it out but i just wanted to bring it to everyone's attention that if you sprint into your synergy it just will not work so we sprint boom won't work you can sprint at the beginning of it See, I'll, sh I'll show you. You can sprint at the beginning of it and stop. Oh, actually, no. You just don't want to sprint in this at all. So each time you sprint, it doesn't work. And then one time you don't sprint, it works every time. So it, it, it's some sort of lame sprint bug. I don't know what it is, Zoss, but I, I feel that that should be pretty easy to fix. So that's the first major kind of game breaking bug for, or class breaking bug for the class because let's be real, guys. Like, when you go for the harmony builds, you go for all in. Like, you all in. So when you drop your harmony and you can't activate the synergy, it's like, okay, well, uh, I'm dead. And that, that's pretty much what happens. So the next game breaking cl well, class breaking bug is I don't really have clips of this, but I just want to bring it to you guys' attention. If you drop your boneyard and you get CC'd as it drops, when you break CC, come back to activate your synergy, it'll be gone as well. 
as if as if it's a sprint bug. I wish I had clips of that. It's, it's a little bit easier said than done. I have a few you know instances on my live stream which I could have clipped off, but I just want to bring this bug to your guys' attention as well. So to recap, there is a uh, a ninja nerf to harmony. You know, confirm. You know, Nice Gaming confirm that it puts a half a second delay on activating your own synergy for the harmony lineup. So you're kind of forced to use dark convergence to hit it consistently which is a uh, really unfortunate you know it the pool effect alone brings everyone together um, that's the only reason i even use dark conversions on the macro right now just for the pool effect but uh that's uh that's bug number one bug number two is a sprint bug so if you try to sprint into your synergy you won't be able to activate it and bug number three is that if you get cc'd as you drop your boneyard you break cc you try to activate your synergy it just won't proc so in order to combat that you have to drop another boneyard and if you're running dc like i am uh your your dc is already dropped on the ground and you're losing out uh, a lot of that uh that usefulness there but yeah that's been the video guys like keep it short and sweet i know it's monday uh happy weekend happy monday start of your weeks hopefully your, your guys' days are going just peachy again guys i'm doing pvp top five series please send me send me your clips i've gotten some amazing clips i really want this to kind of catch on i know chris for eso is doing something he's been doing this for hundreds of episodes now uh he's definitely the the big dog when it comes to uh, ESO PvP top five clips, but if your clips do not make it there, I would be happy to do a rendition of his top five as well. Just to try to get your guys' content out there because I know there's a lot of great people out there, a, a lot of great 1BX, there's a lot of great theory crafters and unique builds. So I just want to kind of spread awareness and kind of get you guys out there. And yeah, um, hopefully you enjoyed today's video. I will be streaming later on today at 5 p.m. EST if I can go ahead and get this video uploaded. And yeah, again, guys. 72% not subscribed. Please throw your boy work a bone. That'd be greatly appreciated. That's all I have to say. Peace.